All right, so basically everybody saw it, right? We'll just get the damn. Listen, the info if you out, haven't right? seen it, YouTube it. It's Every, everywhere. Yeah, it's on YouTube. If you haven't seen it, but you heard about it, the Oscars, right? Chris Rock made a GI Jane joke about <laughs> Jada Pinkett Smith and her short hair. Uh, who suffers from alopecia, uh, who now, now all of a sudden it's a movement. Nobody cares hey, about hey. bald people. Slow down, judge. Nobody cares about bald people. Slow now down, now all of a sudden, because two freaking famous people here, went here. bald. Here. Now everybody cares. Anyway, too sorry. Too sorry. Anyway. JB's, uh, about to, JB's about to object. So, <laughs> so, <coughs> so what I'll say is this. Will Smith, right? Everybody saw it. Will Smith slapped the shit out of Chris Rock after he made a G.I. Jane joke. And uh, the argument here is, did Chris Rock go too far? Or did Will Smith go too far, right? Is, is Will Smith justified in defending his wife's honor? Uh, or was he completely out of line? Save right? it for my arguments, Who's Judge. the asshole? Play the intro. <laughs> get my shit ready. Go ahead, play that intro. I'm out. I'm out. Not your intro. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> You go first, so I get my mind right. Uh, do not fuck. Alopecia. 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 I'm in robe. Coach, I got my robe on backwards, no, folks. Let me, <laughs> nice. But nice. it's all good. Nice. Hey, listen, court's in session. We're high. We're smoking. Yeah. No, we're listen, high. you only had, if you're a Miss Universe, you've only had 30 seconds to get <laughs> wardrobe changed. I would so. be screwed if I was Miss Universe. Yeah, not too bad. You got your hair did. It's you all got good. your next it's dress all, yeah. on. Thank you. I appreciate you. <laughs> all right. Uh, yeah. Court's in session, folks. The Honorable Frank, oh, the boy. Tank, the Honorable Jimmy Puffett. Yes. Yes, make uh, it was funny. We are here to decide on whether the court of public opinion, right? The court of public opinion, not who's guilty or who's innocent, but who in this case is a dick. Mm -hmm. Uh and who and who we're going to judge, right? That's what we do here on the Potheads. We judge people. All right. Big Ace, who are you defending in this case? I am the prosecution against Will Smith. Against Will Smith. So I am on Chris Rock's side. <laughs> I will make my arguments and I will prove to the court that Will Smith is guilty of assault Oof. and being a bitch. Okay. Bitch. All right. Oh, he's your and, lawyer. And uh, JB, JB, you're, I guess, arguing against Chris Rock. Yeah. Uh, more in the defense of Will Smith here. Listen, uh, ladies, uh, the man was there for all of you, defending all your honor. So we'll, uh, we'll get there. I hope. <laughs> oh, God. Just trying to fix this damn road. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking arm. <laughs> arm is caught in the damn thing. It's annoying as shit. Uh, All right. Now you look good. Now we're good. Now yeah. we're good. Pressed. Feathered. By the way, the G.I. Jane Joan was funny. Right, it right. was funny. Right. I thought it was funny. It was the funny funny. thing is Will Smith laughed himself at it. But I, I, listen, I won't steal anybody's right. thunder. Make your arguments. I will open it up. Big Ace. <clears throat> big Ace. Before I start my opening right arguments, no, you know what? I'm going to save my my evidence, my exhibit for later. Oh, God. <clears throat> let, let me start by saying it's never okay to put your hands on somebody. But I understand. I will never fault a man for defending his wife or the hey, woman he loves. Check. My problem isn't that he defended his wife. It's the way in which he chose to go about it. He went about it in a childish manner. You are worth $300 million. You are a man and That's a professional. A <laughs> you are a professional and you are in the, on the largest stage for your profession. And you acted like a child. The man, Chris Rock is a comedian. One of the best there's ever been. Comedian's job is to make light of the things that are happening. <laughs> comedian's, uh. The comedian's job is to make light of these things and to make jokes. Chris Rock said afterwards that he had no idea that Jada Pinkett Smith had alopecia. He thought she was rocking the bald head like her daughter had done before. He thought it was a fashion statement. He made a joke about it. Will Smith smiled. He laughed at the joke. And it wasn't until Jada gave him the the funky eye that she went ahead, that he went ahead and acted like a big baby. Okay. 
He walked up on that stage and he slapped that man. First of all, that's assault. That's assault, my brother. <laughs> okay. We know this. Had that been anyone else? Huh. But listen, I digress. <laughs> if it was anybody. You, you assaulted the man. You embarrassed him. Okay. And if you ask me, would he have done the same if it was someone else? Chris Rock is the most mild-mannered, goofy, non-threatening person in all of Hollywood. No one ever thinks of Chris Rock as being a tough guy or a mean-spirited person. Okay? I feel like Will Smith took advantage of a situation and said, I get away with smacking the shit out of this guy. He ain't going to do nothing. But if you watch the video... The Brooklyn almost came right out of Chris Rock for a second there because he, he looked like he was going to do something. He stopped. He laughed. He even said, he said, boy, I, you know what? And he kept it going. Mm -hmm. I commend him for that. He acted like an adult. I want you to go ahead and play my exhibit though. Cause even if he knew about the alopecia, listen to this. Okay. This is actually a funny commercial and not a creepy one. Oh, Oh, there you go. Hey, check this out. Here's the situation. Say you out with your boyfriend, your girlfriend. You know, you're at school. You had a club or something, getting busy. Right, you're just having fun. Somebody steps up <laughs> to you and they now? tell you they want to rumble. All right, now, now just stop for a second. Before you lose your head, get all crazy, uh. toss your hands up. Just think. The person that uses the head can always defeat the person that's just trying to use their hands. Now, remember that, because the more you know. So <laughs> that's, that's number one. So Will is my, Smith is my doing other the more you know. Is the other video on there? I don't see it. I don't. Okay, so we're slacking here. All right, time, time. No, 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 time. no, 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 no. We, need to, we, we do need Listen, to move this along, time. though, sir. We well, do my other along. exhibit is a video in which, you know what, I'll play it for y'all right here. I play my exhibit because it is pertinent to the case. And here we go. Liar? <laughs> Liar? <laughs> that was it? <laughs> no. He just snorted. <laughs> <laughs> He's the only no, one in his joke over serious. there, guys. <laughs> Jeez, big ace. Come on, let's go. Wait a damn. This guy. To learn to get the courage to just go, nah, I'm not doing that. Which is why I feel the freedom today. I don't give two craps what people feel about this bald head of mine. Guess okay, well, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's okay. So if you don't give two craps what people feel about the bald head of yours, why the hell did Chris Rock have to get the shit slapped out of him? Okay, well. But okay, you know but what? You're talking gonna, about, I'm, yeah. And, and my closing arguments is I'm going to say this. Regardless of defending your wife or whatever, the bigger picture is what is, is the biggest thing for me. For years, we've been bitching and moaning about Oscars so white, about black people not getting representation in the Oscars, right? And here you are, the favorite, the odds-on favorite to win Best Actor, and you pull this bullshit. So now, what you've done was allowed those people that didn't want y'all there in the first place to sit back and say, see, I told you. Hey, black I told you we can't have these guys around because look what they do. Mm, set them back, man. So, and, and Will Smith's been on his best behavior for over 25 years in Hollywood. It, right. But he you know what? Guess what? He won Best Actor. Does anyone give a shit about that? All, mm -hmm. all we're hearing about is the slap. It's a good point. It's a good point. Will so Smith you just <laughs> overshadowed... <laughs> You just uh, overshadowed yes. your crowning achievement. Yeah. The crowning achievement of your career, you shit all over it mm -hmm. because you wanted to be a tough guy. Fuck oh, you, Will Smith. Oh, boy. Will Smith, I love you, brother. This one's tough. Let me just do a little cross-examination uh, on my part. I believe the last court we had, we talked about Masvidal and defending his fucking honor. and You got to do what you got to fucking do, man. I never no said that. Who you you said that it is no, the no, rules. No. It's the, I, I, can I cross the fence? Can on, I cross? Can I cross? I didn't say that he was right for doing it or that he was supposed to do it. I said I understood because that's where he comes from. That's the type of person that he is. Okay. Well, you just shat it on Will Smith for committing assault, for doing this. Well, isn't that where he came from? Maybe in where he comes from? That's where why you from defend. That way. You ever see him do that shit? West okay. Philadelphia. Okay. He's I mean, the softest motherfucker to ever oh, come out of Philadelphia. Okay. Again, judge, uh, you know, hearsay, fucking, I don't okay, know, okay. something. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'll, I'll, I'll say that. I'll say that. Uh, you can't pick and choose, right? 
Uh shit, where am I gonna go? Uh, do you remember when we when we all hated on Donald Trump for making fun of the uh you know the disabled people? Yeah, uh, you know, you remember everybody knows yeah, what I'm talking yeah. about, and everybody shat on Donald Trump. You know, did anybody go slap him? No, okay, but my, my point, my, my point wish. is in the moment Will Smith felt that Chris Rock was making fun of a autoimmune disease. I believe it's an autoimmune disease, right? Yeah. Uh, do, do comedians make jokes on AIDS? Do yes. they do that? Do they? Yes. Is it, do they? I haven't, I have, okay, I'll say I haven't heard one in a while. <laughs> yes. Uh, They're always making jokes on, I mean, hello, yeah. this guy, uh, uh, not cool necessarily enough? AIDS, but Dave Chappelle just made all these jokes, you know, about the LGBTQ. He and, and, about and, and, AIDS. <laughs> I and he has made joke the about autoimmune AIDS. disease. Like everybody makes jokes about that kind of stuff. They weren't at a roast, but yeah. Okay, exactly. I think, I think I think the point you're trying to make is that when it comes to comedy, everything is. It, yes. Okay. Again, you said it. They weren't at the roast. They weren't at an Oscars. Uh, Will Smith felt felt that he had to stand up for him and his. Granted, the second part of my defense uh, for Will Smith uh, is Jada herself. I mean, let's be truly honest. If Red Table Talk didn't come out, if all that August Alcina debacle didn't come out two years ago, this would have never, ever, 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 ever have happened. Granted, I understand that my client and his wife have an open relationship, that that may not have been the same situation, right? Will Smith didn't go up to August Alcina and slap him, right? I mean, he just banged your wife. Why wouldn't you? It's not <laughs> the same situation, right? The, 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 the story is that it was an open relationship, that he knew about it, that they slept over whatever. Uh, in this situation, okay, for the last two years, that's what everybody's been talking about. 50 Cent, comedians left and right. He has literally been getting clown for the last two years. Literally getting clown. And he ain't slapped of. none of them niggas. Okay, all right. I may I I agree that Will Smith took advantage of who was up there, that he would not have done it if another bigger, stronger, you know, whatever you want to call it, comedian was up there. But it was the the, the 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 straw that broke the camel's back. And literally, it was a straw. It was a funny joke. It was a funny joke, and he didn't know about it. So G. I'll give G. you that. Did you, badass. Did this, does but this it have was any... the straw, and it broke him. And he felt like he had to do defend his honor. Does this what have any... Does this weigh anything to either of you guys? I saw this. I thought this was interesting. The, the actress that basically... The person who played G.I. Jane cheated on her husband with the dude... That from the what? 70s show, she who was much she younger. Don't... Her and Bruce Willis were divorced. I don't know she... if that's true or not. Uh, I but... love the so that's so the... people nah. are making all kinds people of connections. No, no, no. So you're nah. so so, but you're putting this on Jada. This is not on Chris Rock. Is that I, your the point fact, here? The fact that I know now as a defense attorney, right, that that Chris Rock did not know of her medical condition, I can't use that as a defense because it is what it is. I can't use it as a defense. <laughs> so all I got left. Exactly. All, Put Mike's comment all up there. I got, all I got left is Jada. Jada is a little bit toxic. I'm just going to go ahead and say it out there. She, without, what, what movie was it? Woo? Was it right? Woo or Woo, whatever? yeah. Ever since that in The Matrix, right? Where has Jada been? Let's put that comment nowhere so she creates the red table talk and starts putting all her dirty laundry you think will smith wanted his dirty laundry put out like that and i say dirty because people do that kind of stuff but look at the results of all this after that That's kind true. of information came out look at look at what just happened at the oscars it was because of jada and her dare i say it, attention yeah narcissism like me 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 i want i need more I, I, Ah, uh, I stand by Will Smith. He still carried out the action. If somebody, listen, if if your wife pays somebody to murder you, right? Your wife is just as guilty as you are. Just because she paid the guy to murder True. you doesn't mean that he gets off for oh, murder. Man. So, uh, yeah, she made a given. Well, made that's, 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 that's not exactly the same thing because she did not. Yeah, she did not. I say she tell him go. to do anything. She gave him that look. He was laughing until she gave him the look. 
you know, people well, I, I, react reactively. Here's a look. Here's a look that I Maybe, think she gave. It took a second. I'm gonna rule in. I'm gonna rule on this because we are going running long today. Uh, the look that I th- I believe Jada Pinkett Smith gave Will Smith was not go get him. It was how the hell are you sitting here laughing at me about this damn thing? Mm-hmm. Because you. he was laughing and clapping to the joke, and I think that if he what he did. Was deflect off him laughing? Was like, Damn. oh shit! I better show out Do so something. I don't get in trouble. Uh, but I don't know. That's that's just me personal. I have heard your guys' arguments. Last thing, go ahead. This is not part of the argument. But my question is: Did he get a pass because he's Will Smith? And uh, yes, yes. I mean, you saw that. Well, what I'm saying yes. is that had did he get a pass because he's Will Smith and because it was Chris Rock? If he had gone up there and slapped Jerry Seinfeld. Would they let him go sit okay. back down? So, so yes, that, 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 and yes, he got away with it because or he's Will Smith. You understand? So yes to both been, answers. Had this been fucking Ja Rule up there and 50 Cent walked up and slapped okay, him, so would that's, they allowed him to no, go sit back no, down? No, no, no. He gets a I'm, pass because he's Will Smith. Because he's Will Smith and Rich. He's the, he's, Will Smith is the, the left Hollywood. Like, he is... He is the he does documentaries for animals. <laughs> he travels the world. He cooks. He cleans. Live free. Look at me and my wife. Free love. Look at my kids. I don't give them any rules. Whatever they do, whatever. He's the leftist black guy. So yes, he gets. They they sat him down, gave him a round of applause, and gave, gave him an him Oscar. Award. Yeah, he got <laughs> away with it. He yeah, gets. He got up there and cried. Yeah. He got up there and cried. And everybody felt bad for him. Yeah. This is Jada's uh, fault. Yeah, I'll say like, it again. Fuck out of here. All right, I, I'm ready to rule. I'm ready to rule. Uh, I'll say this: you guys b- both make very compelling arguments, very much so. Uh, I, I I don't condone uh, that kind of violence, and I you know, and and I would say that by nature, I probably lean on a more violent, I have more violent <laughs> tendencies. Uh, however, I think that as enlightened creatures, especially when you're a freaking millionaire and you've done all these roles and you you are so left and enlightened and all this stuff, right. and you just did it the more you know freaking video <laughs> like 20 years ago, whatever. <laughs> I think I think Will Smith should not absolutely have not put his hands on anybody. I don't think anybody should have walked up and done that. I didn't even like when Nicki Minaj stepped to Miley Cyrus yeah. at the I think MTV Awards or something like that. When Kanye went up her. there, yeah. it made me cringe. Bro. Yeah, because it's Come just on. like you know you're really putting that other person in an awkward spot. Yeah. What the hell are they supposed to do? Uh, I don't think that anybody gave a damn about Chris Rock or his family. How is everybody still talking about Will Smith? How does nobody care about what? What do you think Chris Rock's kids and his wife? felt like watching their dad, dad. their husband, yeah. or his parents, their yeah, son straight getting slapped on, on the one of the biggest nights of his life. I, I, I'm pretty sure he's hosted the Oscars before, yeah. um, but it's a big deal. So uh, you're getting slapped in front of millions. Uh, so I think, it's, I think it was foul on his part. However, I do agree with the argument that this is, this is a buildup. This is Jada Pinkett mm-hmm. Smith putting their relationship on social media. This is Jada Pinkett Smith taught, making this man cry, turning Will Smith into a meme yeah, by putting their... Will Smith, feel good. everybody has known that Will Smith and no Jada matter. Pinkett Smith has had this open relationship, this free love relationship. But guess what? Have anybody at this table, at this purple table talk, <laughs> has anybody at this table... Uh, Ever heard about Will Smith with another woman? No, I'm sure he has been. Oh, He's pl- but guess what? Yeah. He was discreet about it, and he, he messed respectful. with bitches that knew how to keep their mouth shut. Out of the respectful, rules. exactly. That's she the put, rule. she dragged this man's his name through the whore. mud. He kept a smile on his face through the whole time. Supported her, had her back, and then, and I think it was just a buildup. Fifty Cent. Right. Uh, other actors, uh, you know, I can't remember half of them, but everybody's been giving Will Smith shit for two years. years. And then all of a sudden, Chris Rock says one joke. And then I think it was a combination. It was an opportunity. He was trying to save face. He felt like he could get away with it. Uh, I, you know, so many things were wrong in this situation. But if I got a rule on one side, I think that I've got a rule against Will Smith. Will Smith is in control here. He's a grown ass man. And regardless of who's truly at fault, and I really do blame Jada here. Uh, and I have a bone to pick with the Academy. I don't like I don't like the Oscars as it is because of how I felt about, you know, the the way they treat people of color and all that stuff. Uh, but 
I think Chris Rock should sue the Academy. I think that they failed to protect an employee this night. I think the fact that they didn't uh, kick Will Smith out and that they gave him a freaking award right after, after sat there and let him, you know, uh, cry up on play stage. Or, yeah. Play the victim. I think was absolutely uh, uncalled for. If I was Chris Rock, I'd have been like, if you, Oh, if I was Chris Rock, I would be absolutely uh, sick to my stomach with the Academy and I would ha- want to have nothing to do with them. That being said, again, Will Smith, guilty. You're okay, a douchebag. Yeah. Uh, if it was we'll, The Rock, like like Stephen A. Yeah, and other people yeah. said, if it was The Rock and not Chris Rock, he yeah, wouldn't have yeah. smacked. He wouldn't have said, he just sat yeah. in his damn seat and told Jada to calm the fuck down. Hey guys, it's Frank the Tank here. And if you like what you saw in today's episode, make sure to hit that subscribe button below. And for all new fresh content, go ahead and click right on over there. Watch out, Big Ace. And if you want to watch some of our more classic episodes, go ahead and click right on that way. (laughs) Every wee Wednesday in the Cypher with the Potheads. Yep.